Hello guys and welcome to a video on the background of the unholy alliance between France and the Ottoman Empire. In the game, both the French and the Ottomans are notoriously known for arguably being the two most powerful nations in the game, with the Ottomans being the fourth biggest great power and France being the fifth biggest great power. So when these two nations do occasionally ally in the game, you can imagine most of Europe is not too happy about it. So without further ado, let's get into what actually happened when these two countries did ally 80 years after the start of the game, and why it was so significant during that time. We start by going back to 1396, where French and Ottoman relations were not so great. France had a joint crusade against the Ottomans with Hungary, and lost it badly, which led to the Marshal of France being captured during the crusade. These bitter battles led to relations being rough throughout the 15th century. In 1483, the Ottoman ruler at the time, Bayezid II, tried to send an ambassador to the French king to negotiate for the release of his brother, but the French king refused to see the ambassador. These icy relations may have continued, and Europe may have never seen the alliance, but over a period of the late 15th century and early 16th century, things began to rapidly change in Europe. The Ottomans expanded their empire over the Balkans, and the Habsburg dynasty in Central Europe began to have more land and more power all over the place, which worried the French. The Habsburgs began to bully the French in a number of ways, making the King of France, Francis I, despise the Habsburg ruler, Charles V. The pinnacle of this bitter conflict was in 1525, when Francis was imprisoned and wounded by the HRE Emperor in the Battle of Pavia. Francis had to sign a humiliating treaty called the Treaty of Madrid, and the reports were that Francis was no longer the same person after this, having excessive mood swings and inconsistencies in his statementship. This humiliation triggered him to send an envoy to Suleiman the Magnificent to attack the Habsburg Empire from the east. The Ottoman Sultan replied, sympathising with the French king, and took this opportunity to attack Hungary in 1526. Over the next few decades, both France and the Ottomans became closer. In 1532, both countries exchanged embassies and began to coordinate attacks against the Habsburgs, and Suleiman the Magnificent saw the French king as his brother. Both France and the Ottomans had trade, financial, and military agreements during the 16th century, therefore increasing the power of both nations. Some notable examples are when the French king allowed Barbarossa to winter in Toulouse in 1541, and the joint siege of Nice in 1543, where the French and the Ottomans attacked together. I think this alliance was exceptional. It was the first non-ideological alliance between a Christian and a Muslim state. So despite the conflicting cultures and religions, they were able to work effectively together. As you can imagine though, it wasn't taken well in the Christian world. Many historians thought this alliance saved France from the control of the Habsburgs. And I think it would be interesting to add an event in EU4, where if France is losing a war to the Austrians, then there may be a chance that the Ottomans send aid if they occupy Hungary. Thank you guys for watching, and let me know what you think in the comments about the alliance. Hello my children, I must give you a message. Subscribe to the social streamers for eternal salvation.